<laughs> Always enlightening to listen to the pregame huddle, huh? It's Friday night, and live on 2K Sports, we're going to bring you the NBA in all its excitement. This is Kevin Harlan with my broadcast partners Steve Kerr and Clark Kellogg. Some confidence for Golden State with the win in their last matchup against the Grizzlies. And with the success they had from behind the arc in that game, you knew they were going to be in good shape. Yeah, especially with that kind of long-range shooting. I mean, that's difficult for a team to overcome. And now, presented by State Farm, Golden State starting group. Steph Curry and Thompson manning the backcourt. In the middle, it's David Lee and Andrew Bogut. And it's Big Red in at the three, the small forward. And for Memphis, hey, hey, right here, right the great trio in the front court: Rudy Gay, Zach Randolph, and Marcus Hull. Wayne Ellington is... Oh, 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 man, that was unreal. Mark it up. Nasty, nasty. Whoa. <laughs> and that look right there on Clark says it all. He's <laughs> not alone, Kevin. I mean, that was just mean right there. No. The pass to Ellington. He dishes it to Gay. Oh, yo, kick it out. Shot is off. So Golden State will take it the other way. This game coming on the heels of their win against Chicago. Yeah, they did everything well in that game. Solid Andrew, Andrew. across the board, particularly at the offensive Shot, end. Shot. Yeah, the definition of teamwork, Steve. Communication, passing, catching cleanly. Um, they worked extremely well together all game long. Outside Conley, back to game. Let's it go from 11. That's good. And it's his poise at the offensive end that impresses me most. This guy is unflappable. All right, let's go over to the sideline with Doris Burke. Well, Kevin, I had a chance to catch up with Mark Jackson. On his mind, the difficult task of defending Zach Randolph. He said, Randolph's especially tough because he's not only a go-to scorer on the low block and the pinch seven, post, seven, seven. but also a guy who can pick up a lot of second chance points with his work on the glass. He's a 20 and 10 double-double guy for a reason. We'll have our hands full trying to slow him down. Guys, back to you. All right, Doris, thank you very much. Well, it was the Memphis Grizzlies in their last game, a loss to Indiana. Yeah, they allowed far too many open looks in that game, guys. Can't disagree with you there, Steve. I mean, that's exactly what did them in. They didn't apply nearly enough pressure on their shooters. Six on the shot clock. Check the clock, check the clock. Conley against Curry. Got the ball. Conley's shot is off. And so it's Golden State with it. Here's Big Red. The first quarter of action, two minutes in. And the rebound goes to the Grizzlies. And now here comes Conley leading the break. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh, that was a power yes. punch right yeah. there. Oh, great. He's definitely showing some real sweet dunking skills here. Are you kidding me? Oh, my gosh. What a play. Yeah, that was What's spectacular. Play? Here's Big Red. He's covered by Gay. Cannot hit. Now the Grizzlies take it the other way. And a little over two and a half minutes gone here in the first. That's a huge part of what they want to do defensively. Limit his easy chances inside. Hasn't had a whole lot of misses here in the quarter. Very sharp shooting right now. It's fun to watch. The Grizzlies trail by three. Conley with it. He had a 12-point outing in their last game against Indiana. And uh, how is the last shaping up, guys? Well, let's uh, take a moment here to check it out. Now that the mid-season grind is well underway, you look at Golden State and checking out Memphis just way behind. You know, taking a look at Memphis, um, they've tried and tried to get the season turned around, and nothing has clicked so far. Isn't it funny, Clark? I mean, sometimes the chemistry just doesn't work for a team. And even though the talent looks like it's there to, uh, to have a good team, uh, it, it just doesn't work. And, and for this club, that's exactly what's happened. Swiped away. And out of the court come the Warriors on the break. Well, we should keep an eye on him because normally he's good for one or two highlight reel dunks. I mean, this guy can absolutely fly. And I think he's one of the best at finishing in close quarters, too. I mean, it's very hard to knock him off his shot. 
109 left here in the first quarter. It's Gay with the drive. Tries again. And Randolph with the layup. He will fight you down low, guys. Really battles in there. He comes up with a lot of second chance buckets. Both teams will make substitutions. Now here's Jenkins. Right now averaging seven points a game. That's good. Big Reds have got 14 points for the game. Tell you, they might have to make a defensive adjustment. They can't give him that kind of a look from beyond the arc. Out of bounds, Golden State takes possession. And another mistake. This is embarrassing. I mean, you've got to make better decisions than that. The Grizzlies making a switch here. Ondex is checked in. And then for Golden State, Marks is checked in. And Steph Curry subbed in for Charles Jenkins. This is not the slam dunk contest. You don't get do-overs. You got to finish the job. And up the court come the Warriors on the break. Lays it in off the breakaway. He's got 16. And he cannot play any better than he is right now in this quarter, guys. The Warriors making a switch here. The Warriors shooting their first free throw of the night here. Yeah, guys, they can feel very good about themselves when you bring up those statistics. Impressive numbers. Yeah, yeah. Seven second difference, shot and game clock. Oh, 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 oh. Takes it to Arthur. Randolph dishes to Arthur. Conley with the screen on Thompson. Randolph passes to Conley. With two seconds left, can't hit. You expect him to nail that one being that close to the hoop. And after just one quarter of play, a double digit differential on the scoreboard. Warriors lead by 11. Live from the FedEx Forum. And welcome back. It's been all one-sided so far through the first quarter as our second quarter gets underway. And for the Warriors, this has been the game they wanted to have. Hey, I was hey, impressed with their transition game, guys. They really got out and ran the lanes. Yeah, they did. I mean, no better way to get easy buckets than through fast breaks. Setting the floor for the Warriors. Kent in at shooting guard. He's out there with Steph Curry. Harrison Barnes is out there with Festus Azili. And let's catch up with our sideline reporter, Doris Burke. Doris, over to you. Hey, Kev. Big Red in that last game against the Bulls delivered quite a performance. He ended with 25 points and hit the glass as well, coming away with nine rebounds. Truly impressive numbers from him in a stellar performance. What a special night. Thanks, Doris, very much. I'm sure he's going to carry some of that great momentum part into tonight. And that's the way it works, guys. A big game like that just carries over sometimes. We'll see. Yeah, all of a sudden the rim looks big. Everything seems to come easy, and, and your game just flows. Roten kicks to Gay. Roten. Back to Gay. Over Barnes. Gay can't get it to go. Well, you know what? You really expect him to knock that jumper down when he gets a good look like that. And that's out of bounds. Golden State will retain possession. Well, as usual, a lot of offense in the NBA is being generated from the small forward position this season. And here are the league's best at that position. While you look at Big Red, leading the league in points per game. Such a great player. Well, slasher, scorer, call him whatever you want, but the bottom line is he can tear the rest of the NBA to shreds when he gets going. That's exactly right. I mean, he's the number one guy you have to account for when you take them on. I mean, he's the primary guy in the scouting report. Even if you can't stop him, you've got to try to make him work for his opportunities. Another open look hits bottom from outside. Yeah, and that's three of their last five makes from beyond the arc. So both teams changing it up here. And now we get a chance to see how the Grizzlies are doing in the NBA rankings right now. Eighth in three-point field goal percentage. Thirteenth in field goal percentage. And they're in the top half of the league in free throw shooting as well. Pretty good, but they could certainly stand some improvement there. Yeah, this is a team that, that shoots the ball well, and I think the key is their accuracy from the three-point line. You look at that number in the top ten, as you talked about, Clark. You know, they've leaned on this of late particularly, and I think their success from the three-point line has really allowed their offense to open up and become more balanced. Doubled by Conley. Here's Kent. It's rebounded by Memphis. And for those of you just joining us, we're almost two and a half minutes into the second quarter. 
Conley dishes to Gasol. Stolen. For the finish. Oh, oh, look out. Watch no. out for oh, oh, oh. Now that was pretty. That was just a nice looking reverse jam right there. Use the rim, Clark, to protect the ball, I think, too, a little bit. Yeah, yeah. did a nice job with it. Yeah, no question, Kevin. Great awareness and a terrific finish. Conley off the pick from Gasol. Six feet out. Conley's shot is off. Warriors leading by 14. Here's Big Red. He kicks it to Lee. Passes it to Jenkins. Good! He is always so in control, guys. Even when he's going hard to the hoop. Very skilled finisher. And in the second quarter, a little under three and a half minutes played already. He feeds it to Miles. Feeds it to Arthur. Over Lee. Nice shot by Arthur. Warriors have gone four of six from the field here in the second. Get Doubled him, by Conley. And there's the feed to Bogut. Buries it down low. Keeping up the pressure here. I like that. When you have a lead, don't let up. Yeah, this game could be over soon if they keep pounding it the way they are. Outside Conley. Dishes it to Pondexter. Conley. Arthur sets the pick for Conley. There's the dish to Gasol. Back to Conley. Rocket six. Shoots over Jenkins. Another miss by Conley. And he's having all sorts of problems with his shot. I'm not What's sure he even that? has a shot right now, Steve, to be quite honest. Not a reliable one anyway. Here's Big Red. Oh, oh, oh ridiculous. What a move. Tore it down that time. <laughs> Man, oh man, finishing with flavor. Yeah, he put something extra on that one. You're right. And the bench going wild, guys. They love it. What an amazing dunk. And Big Red gets the win. So as we conclude the first half, so far, fairly one-sided. And now, brought to you by Sprint. This is too... Well, we're getting back to the action now. It's been a one-team show so far. We'll see if that changes here in the third. It's been one outstanding game from Big Red. Now he's just carving up this defense with his ability to cut and get to the hoop. And some of his finishes at the rim, Steve. Wow. I mean, come on. I mean, he's given his squad just what they needed. Rudy Gay, Zach Randolph, and Mark Gasol, the front court. Oh, kick it out. Only out there with Wayne Ellington. That's the group for Lawrence Frank getting going here in the second half. There's the double team with Randolph. And Thompson kicks to Lee. Drops in the layup for two. And the Warriors lead by 18. Offensively just hammering away in the paint. And that's 10 straight points inside, too. Here's Conley. Still looking to get on the scoreboard. It's Gay with the drive. Nine feet out. It's hauled in by Bogut. Bogut's got three rebounds now in this one. Here's Big Red from outside the arc. Good, and Curry gets the assist. Big Red's got 30 points. That shooting percentage is off the charts, guys. He's really hitting his shots today. Hey, hey, Curry against Conley. Gay. Oh, a little added hang time right there. Yeah, letting himself down easy, it looks like. Soft landing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a little better for the knees, so I don't blame him. Here's Kent. Oh, my oh, goodness. How about that? High wire flying yeah. out there. <laughs> That'll drop your jaw. Up, up, and away. He was in the clouds <laughs> on that one, folks. Elevation, gentlemen. That's what we just witnessed. Mm. Man, can he get up there or what? The Grizzlies trail by 21. Got a piece of it. And it's out of bounds. The Grizzlies able to retain possession here. Let's see the stat sheet here on Michael Conley. Over the last month, making major contributions. Ninth in assists. And showing what a good defender he is. And especially his ability to play passing lanes. 
He ranks among the top 15 in the league in steals per game. And, you know, looking again, Steve, at his place among the top 10 assist men, he's been providing a lot of room service dimes to his teammates, and I hope they appreciate it. The shot by Ellington, no good. Great close out there, forcing the Aaron shot. Well, he made it a tough shot again. He didn't give up on it, and he got a hand up. Even with that miss, they're shooting 75% coming out of the break. That's a strong start to the half. Into Zach Randall. Sinks that one from the post. You don't need much range to hit from that distance, Kevin. And now we get a chance to view the NBA's best setup men. Fourth, Michael Conley. You know, the best passers... Randolph kicks to Ellington. Some nice passing there by Memphis. We've gone about three and a half minutes into the third now. Roten, the pass to Ellington. And that one's good. Ellington's got four points in the quarter. Boy, they are really getting chewed up inside here. I mean, that's eight of the last ten points they've given up inside, in the paint. Yeah, and the paint should be sacred ground for a defense. I mean, you can't let anybody just trot in there and get an easy bucket. Well, I think we'll see a lot of three-point shooting. I mean, that's kind of who he is. He's got that deep range, and with his confidence when he gets going, look out. And his focus when he's shooting, really impressive. I mean, he doesn't get rattled, very composed, even when the defense is right on top of him. He's still able to knock down shots. Out of bounds, Golden State takes possession. Here's what Memphis has lined up on their schedule. They'll be playing host to Toronto for the next one. And that's the third of four straight played at home. Boy, that, you take a look at that Celtics game. That's one they'd really like to have. Here's Big Red. Get him! Come get him! The 11-footer, and he hits the jumper for two. Big Red's got 34. You know, he's given them a nice scoring option through most of this game. There's 42 seconds left in the third quarter. Pass to Gasol. Six to shoot. Tate. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. Lee's got three rebounds now in this one. Here's Big Red. No good. Here is Ellington. He has seven. He dishes it to Gasol. Takes it into the teeth of the D and converts the layup. Gasol's got his first points of the game. And it's going to be out of bounds. The Grizzlies will take it. That's not what they needed there, that's for sure. And as we end the third quarter, a double-digit deficit. We'll make it. Hello, and thanks for joining us, folks. The fourth quarter of play should begin momentarily. Now, let's check in with Doris Burke for the Sprite Uncontainable Game. Doris? Hi, Kevin. We've seen an uncontainable game from Big Red. He's used to being the primary scorer for his team, and with the way he has played here, you can see why. We'll see if he has enough left in the tank to come out strong in the fourth. All right, Doris, I guess no one should be surprised. This is what being a superstar is all about, raising your level and rising to the occasion. Yeah, we've seen him do it so many times in the past, and he's done it again here today. On the court for Golden State here in the fourth. Kent in its small forward. Steph Curry and Thompson manning the backcourt. Bogut out there with Draymond Green. Well, it didn't take long to get those three points back. Nope. An immediate answer right there. Right back at you. And Thompson kicks to Curry. And that one's good. And the Warriors lead by 18. Yeah, saw just a little bit of daylight and went right to the rim. Conley against Curry. Takes it up. And there's the call by the official. They'll count the basket here following the goaltending call. He almost got to that shot in time, but not quite. You can't touch the ball once it's on the way down. Looking at who's out there now for the Warriors. Lee comes in for Green, and it's Charles Jenkins in for Clay Thompson. Warriors leading by 16. Yep. 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 
Here's Big Red. Jacks up a three. And that one's good. Big Red's got 40 points. Now he's playing with an edge here, playing extremely well offensively here in the second half. I'm out called the Grizzlies. Without question, Big Red displaying his skills today. He's definitely rolling offensively. You might not be able to stop him, but you've got to find a way to contain him. And the Warriors making a change here. Thompson's checked in. Gasol, this is to Ellington. Back to Gasol. Can't get it to go. Nice D from Bogut. Here's Thompson. That's good. It's been the story of the game for him. Fortunately, his teammates have bailed him out. And here is Conley. And we're around two minutes into the fourth quarter here. Poke loose. And up the court come the Warriors on the break. And another three for Golden State. Anytime they've needed a hoop, he's taken over one shot after another. Boy, is he playing well. Now the pass to Gasol. Gay outside. Kicks it to Randolph. Some nice passing there by Memphis. Get it, get it, get it. The shot by Ellington, no good. Warriors have gotten every shot they've taken so far in the fourth quarter to go in. That's five in a row to start the quarter. Here's Big Red. Watch outside! Back to Bogut. Oh, it! What's out now? This has been an offensive explosion, guys. They are on fire. How about a volcanic eruption, a flash fire? Defensively. I mean, your guess is as good as mine. Oh, they, good that. they just hope that they cool off at some point. Well, that makes five of their last six makes coming from inside. Yeah, really focused on getting the ball into the paint because they're taking advantage of very porous defense down there. Here's Big Red. Curry, Curry, Curry! There's a minute 47 left in the fourth. Some solid defense from Randolph. The Grizzlies have gone three of five here in the fourth quarter. Pretty good numbers coming out of the break. Conley, the pass to Randolph. Oh, shot's good. Now Curry. 130 left in the fourth quarter. There's the double team with Randolph. So the whistle blows on the shot and two free throws for the contact right there. The first one there falls. Both teams deciding to change it up. And so he makes both from the line. And much more aggressive play has led to more free throw attempts for them here in the second half. You know, that's how you do it, Steve. I mean, defender pressing up on you, you press right back, get into him. Here's Pondexter, and it's Memphis with another. And out of bounds as the Grizzlies gain possession. Looked like some miscommunication there off. So we see the Warriors taking the game here. Not much to be critical of with this win, Clark. Not at all. I mean, they showed up not just.